what is going on welcome back to the jeep and daily channel it is 5 15 in the morning and we are currently headed to the og zilla's house to meet him there and then from there we're going to meet street speed or we're supposed to meet street speed at sheets but we are heading to roush creek today for crawling for cops when we get to roush creek i will see you guys when we get there um i won't know i won't decide if i'm taking my jeep until last minute when i get there anyways so we'll see we'll see guys we made it I am taking my Jeep out I registered I got my wristband we're heading out now let's not break anything <laughs> hopefully I don't rub this shit off I never got it out of the way but when I flex I didn't even think about that shit I'll figure out something if it starts rubbing if anything, it'll just get water flung up into it a little bit, but the air filter and box is still there, thankfully. <clears throat> so the Jeep should still run fine as long as that part doesn't go underwater, suck any water into it. But we're getting ready to head out. Hopefully it's a good day. Hopefully nobody breaks. Hope, especially me, because I have to drive my shit home and it's the only vehicle I got. I think for the time being though, I'm going to switch over to the GoPro 3 and record with that. So if there is a change in quality, video quality, that's why. Um, as long as I can get the GoPro 7 off the stand because it's a little jacked up. But we're getting ready to head out, so I'll see you guys on the trail. Switched over to the GoPro 3. I couldn't get the suction cup to suction to the damn windshield, so hopefully I have some point to try and get that when we get out onto the trail. But I counted 11 cars in our group alone, including me, Mike, and Mikey. Um, but there is a lot of people, mainly Jeeps, seen a few Toyotas, uh, two or three Rock Bouncers, one Ford Explorer, and then obviously Mike Street Speed has his Tahoe. There's one other Cherokee XJ in the group. Everything else is mainly Wranglers besides Mike and Mikey's vehicles. But I'm just praying I don't break anything. I hope I can drive the Jeep home, man. But it's gonna be a fun day no matter what. So buy it. 
Dude, I can already tell how much that welded rear helps right. out. Come over this way. Straighten it out. Oh. Nice and slow. Did it get held up on it? Yeah. Like the frame up. or something? Yeah, that's my big scratch right, marker thing. <laughs> I was stuck on it for a second. I didn't take that yep. turn sharp enough. I hit the tree with my back right. door down Did there. Did you see me bash my mirror off the tree? I saw your bumper hit off of the... Yeah, my bumper smacked <laughs> off the wall. That is tight down there, guys. It might not look like it, but the blazer's a lot wider than the Jeep's. I'm a little upset at myself. I didn't get it, but that spot Mikey was just having a little difficulty with, Mike went full send because he didn't want to get stuck and doesn't have the clearance. And he went off to the right and ran a tree over and kept heading down the trail. And it was cool because he like, he bounced off this rock, ran the tree over. But of course I thought I was recording and I wasn't. So 
That's a little brutal. It would have been cool to have on camera though. I just witnessed. Did you even try? All right, Kyle. Let's see it. It's gonna be a lot less graceful than that. Your turn. That's gonna do it. After event damage is not that critical. There's probably some more scratches that weren't there before. Here comes Mike with the blaze hoe and the Duramax, but and the fenders got a little crinkled and you can tell this one is cooked. I could probably pull it out. Oh yeah, look at that. Like it was never fucking damaged. And then we got a dent in the door back here from hitting a tree. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's a little dent right here from a tree. But that's, that's it. Jeep made it. 
no electric fan to keep the Jeep radiator cool. It didn't overheat. Put air back in the tires. Nothing broke. Some bad noises, but nothing broke. Um, his transmission did, kind of. Um, but that's going to do it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, leave a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Um, be on the lookout for more content. Um, still got some fixing up to do on the Jeep. We're definitely going to be fixing the floors eventually. Um, but other than that, I don't, I mean, mud tires eventually on the Jeep. But other than that, besides little stuff, the Jeep's done. Um, remember, guys, at a thousand subscribers, I will do a burnout. I don't know if I'll blow these tires off or stock tires, but when I hit a thousand subscribers, we will blow a set of tires off of the Jeep and send them out in a blaze of glory for a big thank you celebration. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I'll see you later. Peace out.